Hello and welcome to the Heat Signature Daily Challenge. It is the 6th of August and today we are stealing the three parts of the Malherba Mark II as fast as possible. Uh, we are dying, we are shaky, tough, ex-foundry, and we've got a conk hammer, self-charging swapper, crash trap. Boy, this would be a really nice day to have had the extreme range self-charging swapper that we had yesterday then we could most definitely get into the later parts of the ship. Uh, I'm probably still going to try doing that. We've got the cold fire. All right, let's go. All right, glitch dash. Shotguns. No alarm response. All right. We've got bash dashing today, right? Yeah. Even without other shenanigans, we can go pretty fast. With the entrance right there, I uh, just realized I don't have an auto zoom. Oh well. We're just gonna live without it today. Oh! Oh! <laughs> That was right on. Okay. Maybe... Maybe one second docks aren't possible if I bounced off of that. Although I could have bounced off this corner, maybe. I don't know. Oh, that looks so good. Alright, we still got three seconds, though. So, oh, the target's down there. So I think the most ideal would be swapping with the pilot. Let's see if we zoom out. I'd have to go up a little bit and then down. That's a bit tricky. If I swap with you, that's terrible. That's terror terrible. Might as well have just gone from the beginning and not have a swapper. Uh, if I swap with the pilot, that's good. If I swap with these three, that's good. So as long as I don't swap with this character, then I'm fine. On the other hand, I have to get in here and then get out. And there is not a fast way to do that unless... Okay, so this is like one and a half. One and a half. So, hmm... If I don't, if I just go through normally, I can swap out real quick. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven ish that I save. This is one, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So, yeah, I think. Oh, good thing I, there's an, I accidentally clicked. Good thing there's no one to swap with. I think it's actually faster to go through the ship, steal this, and then get out through here. Because it still takes time to swap in from space. Oop. Uh, let's give you a bonk so we don't get shot. Uh, no alarm response. But you've got a shotgun. Otherwise, I wouldn't have cared. All right. Oh, I forgot about doors. Uh, that's a, that actually doesn't matter because of this. Bonk. All right, uh, we're not doing this in under 10. Let's see, you've got the shotgun, so you're the one that I'm more worried about. That'll get most everybody.
<laughs> that was a bit close. What are you gonna do about this, pilot? Nothing, that's what. Alright, let's get the pod moving. Open crate. Get whatever this is. Did I... Mm, I screwed up. Yeah, I screwed that up. We're gonna get... Well, let's see if we've unscrewed up. Is that a... Oh, crash something. Or... Subverter. Does that help us? That doesn't help us. Alright. We're over 10 our... No, no matter what, so might as well go this way. Oh, I forgot about the X foundry. I should have taken that risk. Oh, man, now I'm tempted to go over here. I am tempted. But I shouldn't. I get two items. And there's a possibility that I can swap back. <sighs> yeah, let's risk it. Oh boy! <laughs> Never punished. Never ever punished. I'm ridiculously lucky in this game. Jeez. How do I have that much luck skill? Alright, shoot this a couple times. Remote control the pod. There we go. 11 seconds. Would that... Would we have... Hmm. I don't think we were getting under 10 either way, but... Maybe we actually were. Or we might have had a possibility. Oh, it didn't matter because we couldn't swap out, so... Alright. On to the next one. Glitch dash. It's... All right, Jammer, Defender. You can just run slash swap past all of them. Should have picked up another shotgun, but oh well. This is way out there. Interesting ship. Pretty small. And 40 seconds alarm response time, so it's orbiting something. Don't have to worry about blowing up. Nice. Thanks, cold fire. Okay. So, the optimal play. I think the optimal play is swap with the captain, pilot, key clone your key, get that. If we're lucky, we can swap out here. That's ideal. Let's get this rotated. Do I think I can do that? Maybe. That's a definitive maybe. I'm gonna leave this here. Thinking. All right, let's recenter the screen. I see the pilot right now, so I just need to return to pod, hop out, and bloop. 
There we go. And we're... We're so lucky. We are so lucky. Just look at that luck. Alright, so I could go over here. Get this. I do have to worry a little bit more about the sentry gun. If I do that. And swap here. I've already got a lot of good stuff. And we're at five seconds, though. I want to minimize time, so I'm going to go down here. Get that in line. Open this. What have we got? Something. It is definitively something. But beyond that, I do not know or care. Yeah, we're at six seconds now, so we have to go... I think we're swapping with you. Nope, let's uh, slipstream it up. Should have done that before. Would it have been faster to just run through the ship? Hmm, I don't know. I did get a four second dock. So, yes, nine. All right, all right. We got at least one non-punished points mission. Let's see what we've got for ship three. Glitch dash shield, we cannot swap in. I need to remember that because I tend to forget that on the steel swap-ins. Forget that ship three just can't be done. Uh, tracker, defender, lots of guards. All right, tracker's the only one that I'm really concerned about. I hope I guess we've got a gun. Okay. Do I think I can get in? I've got a Swapper and a Key Cloner. If the guards are on this side, then I'm screwed. That doesn't... with a Key Cloner, or a, with Slipstreams, that doesn't actually save me that much time, so I think I'm gonna not take the risk. Well, unless it's a really windy hallway, but... even then. Uh, 70 seconds alarm response, so it it's orbiting something, but it might as well not be with how much time it takes to get there. I just checked to make sure I was recording <laughs> for the first time. All right, three seconds, nice and smooth. And yeah, we would not have been able to get in. All right, we could swap here if we wanted to. And can't swap past this. We'll have to deal with that tracker somehow. That's that's a very sketch location for a tracker. If we're fast enough, I think our best bet is to bonk him around the corner. That's scary. And then you can get this key. Not a good place to swap here, either. We have to go... We have to go... Literally opposite ends of the ship. Well... Technically, I don't have to go to this room. Um... There's not really a good swapping spot... Anywhere. So... We'll take the moderate swapping spot. With take them, bash them, get the key. Should I set off the alarm? It'll take one second to set off the alarm. So, yes. I'll do that so that we can get the ship moving out and stabilized. Nope, should have gone earlier. Bonk. Subverter. That helps a lot, actually. That helps a lot. 
Okay, we've got two options for the subverter. Uh, we can use it to take out the tracker easier, which is honestly looking pretty tempting. Or if we can manage without it, we can subvert this door. The other option for these doors to try and cheat it is use a gun to get them to teleport and hope that they open the door. It actually sounds fairly likely. How big is this long range? So I can't... Oh, we've got two items here. We can access one of them with a crash trap. Okay, I don't... Yeah, I'm just gonna subvert you. Let's get a little bit closer. Don't want to subvert the door and not the tracker. Nope. Let's uh, keep running. That's a good plan. Oh, we've also got a loud weapon now. Gotta love it when the guy with shaky hands is the high velocity ra raptor. Okay. Oh, we also had a chance with X Foundry to get a second uh, subverter. Okay. So steal the key card should be. Don't stop right next to the person with the shotgun. Oh god. I think we're fine. We can we can out we can match the speed of bullets. Stop pressing mouse buttons. You're not supposed to do that. Okay. So let's see what our range is. Okay, so I can bring them down, and if we still can't get in. Then we'll move up slightly and try and bring you down. Thank you! Uh, we're at 0.4 on our whopper, so we can't use that for quite a while. Ship is still riding itself. Eh, it's pretty close to being done. Um. Might as well use this key cloner. Clone, clone, steal. We'd have to go out a little out of our way for the steal on this one. We're probably going to break this, blow this up to get out. Because the next window over is very far away. Can't get that. Yeah, I'm just not going to bother with it. Run down here, grab that, run up here, let's get the pod moving. Yeah, there's no way that this is being done. Nope, let's stop. Run back a little bit. Sorry, I forgot something. Steal a key card. Uh, did I finish what I was saying? Oh god, not this again. There's no way this is being done in... Less than 10 seconds. That's just how it be this time. Alright, steal your key card. I want you to not be messing with me. Well, that's uh, one way to mess with me. Alright. At least you've already teleported. Uh, have fun with your fiery demise. I forget if ex these explosions directly kill people with shields. Uh, not a visitor, so I don't care what it is. All right. Let's see. Uh, dead. Alright. 
So room breaches. Oh, they are. They're shotgun and wrenches all the way back there already. Uh, room breaches. Kill. Immediately. No matter what. Good to know. Interesting that I can still see it. That's weird. I was expecting it to fade away. All right. And that is it for today. In theory, maybe. Oh, in theory, maybe a 495 was possible. Maybe. 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 But still, I'm happy with the 490. All right. Yeah, that's a really good dock. I almost got a two-second dock. But then I bonked. That was a different ship entirely. Anyways, we got to swap in from space while you're doing a steel mission. Those are always fun. Just breaking the game and... More ways, more and more ways than if we ever thought possible. I think shout out to shout out to King Redbeard, who used to play the daily challenges as well, who figured out was the one that figured out how long it takes. Well, what happens when the ship unloads and that you can still interact with people while it's unloading and that kind of stuff. It really helped a lot, especially in the cases where you're leaving a ship, you break a window with the target. If you leave first and then pause for four seconds, then the ship is unloaded and then the target gets stuck. And then you have to go back in and get them. It's really good to know that we can avoid that. And also we can abuse that to intentionally keep people on to not harm them. It's a great thing. Anyways, that is all for today. Thank you for watching, and I hope to see you tomorrow.